Sultanamit. Top Copy Palace. Second Courtyard. Gate of Felicity. The Gate of Felicity the entrance into the inner court, in Darun, also known as the Third Courtyard, marking the border to the outer court or Birun. The Third Courtyard comprises the private and residential areas of the palace. The gate has a dome supported by lean marble pillars. It represents the presence of the Sultan in the palace. No one could pass this gate without the authority of the Sultan. Even the Grand Vizier was only granted authorization on specified days and under specified conditions. The gate was probably constructed under Mehmed II in the 15th century. It was redecorated in the Rococo style in 1774 under Sultan Mustafa III and during the reign of Mahmud II. The gate is further decorated with Quranic verses above the entrance and Tugras. The ceiling is partly painted and gold leafed with a golden ball hanging from the middle. The sides have Baroque decorative elements and miniature paintings of landscapes. The Sultan used this gate in the divan made on a square only for special ceremonies. The Sultan sat before the gate on his bayram throne on religious, festive days and accession when the subjects and officials perform their homage standing. The funerals of the Sultan were also conducted in front of the gate. On either side of this colonnaded passage, under control of the chief eunuch of the Sultan's harem and the staff under him, were the quarters of the eunuchs as well as the small and large rooms of the palace school. The small, indented stone on the ground in front of the gate marks the place where the banner of the Prophet Muhammad was unfurled. The Grand Vizier or the commander going to war was entrusted with this banner in a solemn ceremony.